the atlantal axial joint provides 50% of the total rotation of the cervical spine. The atlas lies above with its ring-like structure and rotates around the odontoid process which protrudes superiorly from the axis to the level of the atlas. During the physiological rotation of this joint, it is normal for the lateral mass of the atlas to rotate anteriorly over the axis. This joint produces an average 40 degrees of lateral rotation to each side. In the case of an atlantoaxial rotary displacement, the lateral mass on one side of the atlas is displaced anterior to the superior facet of the axis below. This results in a typical presentation of the cock-robin deformity, which has a chin rotation towards the contralateral side of the dislocation, as well as a head tilt towards the ipsilateral side of the dislocation, as the lateral mass tilts forward. In the presence of this dislocation, the patient will be able to rotate their head to the side contralateral to the dislocated facet joint in order to exaggerate the deformity. However, because of the locked articular processes, they will not be able to rotate towards the ipsilateral side in order to correct the deformity. This can be seen in a dynamic axial CT scan where the rotation of the axis towards the side contralateral to the lesion is possible, but not towards the side of the lesion.